Here's a demonstration of lighting and adjusting a Bunsen burner. First, check if your striker produces sparks. If none are produced, ask your teacher for a new striker. To set up the Bunsen burner, attach the tubing and the burner to the gas jet. Turning the handle parallel to the burner allows gas to flow through the tube into the burner. To light the flame, hold your striker at a 45 degree angle to the top of the barrel and strike. Repeat if necessary. If after several strikes the burner does not ignite, check to see if the handle is completely in line with the gas jet. Also, the valve underneath the barrel controls the amount of gas flow. By turning it clockwise, you increase the amount of gas flow. Once this has been adjusted, try lighting the burner again. Once the burner is lit, there are two ways to control the height and temperature. The valve below the barrel varies the height of the flame. Twisting it clockwise increases the height. Twisting it counterclockwise decreases the height. An ideal flame is 2 to 3 inches in height. To adjust temperature, rotate the body of the barrel. Rotating the barrel counterclockwise increases the amount of oxygen, which creates a hotter flame. Rotating the barrel clockwise decreases the amount of oxygen, creating a cooler flame. Remember that blue flames are always hotter than orange or yellow flames. In your ideal flame, you should see two cones. The top of the inner cone is the hottest part of the flame. When finished, always turn off your Bunsen burner from the primary gas valve, never from the valve on the bottom of the barrel.